Um, our preparation has really been good the last couple of months. Um, we've really worked hard since Norma Plummer and Nicole came into our squad um, as our coaching staff. So really been working hard two weeks in New Zealand before we arrived here in Sydney. So now just um, really looking forward to getting out on that court for our first match. Yeah, it's fun being in Sydney. It has always been my dream to be in Australia, so I'm happy that I'm here. Our goal is to make top 10. Um, obviously, we've, I think we're placed 12th or 13th at the moment, but top 10 is our goal. Yep. Yeah, since maybe a lot of uh, people from here, they don't know how uh, really Zambia play, so they w we want them to see a different uh, type of netball, so that maybe we'll be also on the map. Uh, our expectations are to win. We're not just here to participate. And when we go out there on Friday, we really want to hit the court um, with a proud performance that we are happy with. Yeah, we play a game that it's fast, speedy, just because we are not that tall in terms of build. So yeah, we're hoping to execute that really well. Well, the fans can expect nothing but just excitement in our game of netball. You know, Jamaica bring a different flair to the, to the, to the game. And we're here to actually execute. We're here to actually have fun. And we're definitely here to walk away with that gold medal. You would expect a different team altogether, uh, altogether compared to the 2011, and uh, I would say uh, this year was a uh, was a blessing and uh, was a very uh, fortunate uh, year for us because we got to play the first uh, twice, and uh, and it's uh, it's it's amazing and uh, it's it's a good timing for our build up towards uh, the champs. Oh, we're at, I am at our side. We fight right all the way to the end. We've got heart and soul and the passion for the game and we're going to do ourselves proud. Uh, as usual, as normal, it's a good team and we work so hard. Uh, from the first we saw to the last we saw, this time around I think we have improved some other things uh, which we didn't do well the last time we were in the World Cup, even the Commonwealth Games. Uh, this time around they see a team, a very changed team uh, for Malawi. What we've done at the moment for looking at the World Cup, we, we've looked at our first group um, and we want to make sure that we get into the top two positions, ideally top that group uh, and into the top eight. We're then going to reassess and see who's in the next group and look to be the best we can be is, is what we've come out here, here to do. Uh, yeah, there's like 50% of Sri Lankans like netball uh, and the best thing is that uh, netball is the only one game for ladies in Sri Lanka and they are, the fans of Sri Lanka uh, are watching this uh, championship and they are willing to see the game on 7th. Yeah. Fantastic. And um, you, are you enjoying your time in Sydney? Yeah, of course, sure. It's really cold, and but we are enjoying it. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. 
Yeah, we've had really good preparations. Um, we've been out here for about a week and a half. We actually arrived on the Gold Coast, which was a little bit warmer and I guess just helped the girls to be able to get over the jet lag and settle in. And we arrived in um, Sydney on Monday, so it's great to actually be based now in Homebush and see all the arenas and start to see all the other teams. It kind of gives you a bit of goosebumps and the nerves certainly start to settle in. I'm Trinidad and Tobago's preparation of, um, thus far, I would say, would adjust to um, like fine tuning for Friday's game against Australia. Yeah, the preparation's been going really well. Um, obviously, been at home doing some training programs in our in our home states and and the staging camp in Newcastle, and here we are in Sydney, ready and raring to go for Friday Friday night's game. Oh, fans can expect to to see Australia put out um, the best performances that we we are capable of. You know, we um, we have been working extremely hard and in, in um, improving the the small areas, I suppose, that we can make improvements in and um, playing an exciting brand of netball the Australian way, short, sharp, and fast. I think that's that's what fans can expect to see. Absolutely, to play in front of a home crowd will be a sensational, you know, the, that feeling of walking out in front of, um, you know, 16,000 Aussies, hopefully they're all Aussies screaming for us, would just be um, a dream come true and something that I know um, myself and the 11 other girls will just embrace.